This art might not mean much to you, but for some struggling families, it's helping to make sure they are able to eat at night. The artist is a local dog. Yes, a dog. And the money raised from the paintings goes to Second Harvest Food Bank, and it's already led to the donation of 2,000 pounds of food. And we caught up with the dog's owner in Myers Park to see how this all works. Look at that, such a good girl. This is my bestie, Ivy. Ivy and I do everything together, but she's pretty much known for her art. She paints abstract art. We, we sell them around the world. We were as surprised as anybody when people asked us if, she would, if we could start selling them. Can you paint? Go okay. paint. It's just kind of snowballed into a huge thing. Come on, go paint. Can you paint? Yes, good girl. It didn't feel right to keep the money, um, so we decided to give it to the Humane Society or other charities. Put it in your bag. Good job. We saw the news, the footage of people in line waiting for food at Second Harvest, and we thought that would be perfect. So we divide her her um, profit in between the Humane Society, which is also, I'm sure, struggling for donations, and the Second Harvest Food Bank. Hey, beautiful. Oh, it's gorgeous, Ivy. She just signed those two. I don't know, it just seemed like the right thing to do. People are having a hard time, and if we could help a little, you know, that I think is a, a great thing to do with money. People finding so many creative ways to give back to our community. Uh, along with Channel 9 and all of you, raised over $100,000 for Second Harvest Food Bank. So thanks to all of you who've donated. Thanks for watching WSOC Tonight. Our next newscast here on Channel 9 airs tomorrow morning at 4.30 a.m. Be well, everyone.